Though I was thinking another day that most of you won't try Windows 11 image on virtual machines and your systems. And that gave me an idea to create this video to help you make your Windows 10 look like Windows 11. All required files links are in video description and before doing anything, create system restore point just in case something goes wrong. And with that being said, let's take a look. So today I will actually show you how to make your Windows 10 look like Windows 11. So first up, we will open our browser and here I prepared some links for you guys, which will also be in video description so you can download it for yourself. So here we have Windows 10 Insider Build icons from Nivu uh, on DeviantArt uh, and I will download this uh, from this website and click save right here. Uh, and of course, for this icons to install, we will need 7 TSP from Devil Inside, uh, also on DeviantArt. So I will click download here as well and click save. We'll minimize the browser uh, window. And here I have these two files that I just downloaded. Here I will click extract all. And when that's done, I will also extract 7 TSP. So for this to work, I will go here in this 7TSP extracted folder. Here we have some instructions how uh, this will work. So we will need to rename this uh, ending of the, of the file to exe. Right click and click yes right here. So here we have, an, we have 7TSP GUI exe file. And here we have our icons. So with that being said, here we have 7TSP themes for Windows 10. 1903 so here we have uh, to remove uh, uh, this uh, ending uh, that it says remove so here I will remove this one so the ending will be 7 zip and this is fine so click 7 zip right here go back and we will run right now 7 TSP GUI version 0.6 here we have some agreements to make click yes and here I will add a custom Windows icon pack. Uh, and this is the one we downloaded from DeviantArt from Nivo. So here we have this one, 7-zip, that we just renamed from rename to 7-zip to ending. Click open. Now this will uh, put this file into 7-TSP and, and click uh, for my demonstration or purposes. I will only uh, uncheck this one. So. Uh, for you, I will recommend to you leave this one checked. So click save right here and I will click start patching. So when that is done, I will click restart our computer and I will get back to you when that's done. So when that's done, you should be greeted with this uh, message uh, uh, on your Windows that my our system has been patched. So click OK right here. And as you can see, if I open up my file explorer right here, here we have brand new icons from Windows 11. So right now I will open up browser and search for some files such as taskbar X. Here we have taskbar X from Chris Anderson. Here I will click on the GitHub link. Here we have some releases. Uh, and I will download this stable version right here. Uh, 64 zip. So click save right here. And minimize our Brave browser window. Here we have downloads and taskbar X zipped folder. I will extract it as well right here. So when that's extracted, I will click right here, right click on the taskbar X extracted folder, cut this PC, local disk C, right click create new folder and I will type it the weeks, weeks right here. And then I will paste the taskbar X um, folder right here. I will launch our taskbar X. So we will get our centered icons like so in Windows 11 as well. And I will also launch Taskbar X Configurator so we can adjust some settings and theme our Taskbar as well. 
So here we have our SolidBar configuration. So with that said, click apply right here. We should be good to go with uh, all these settings are fine. I will just go into the Windows settings right here, go to the personalization and I will uh, change the colors of the system to light. So you can clearly see better our brand new taskbar. I know that this uh, Windows start menu isn't right here with other icons, but I think this can be done with the current version of taskbar X. So with that being said, I will go ahead straight to the Microsoft store right here and I will uh, download uh, rounded TB. Right here we have this beautiful app rounded TB and we will get rounding uh, around the, our um, taskbar itself. So I will launch rounded TB right here. And this program will also uh, launch at startup so you can get this rounded uh, taskbar icons uh, or rounded taskbar uh, when you start your Windows app. So here we have the round taskbar icon right here on the right here. Um, so right here uh, and here we have margin and corner radius. I will put margin to one and I believe corner radius we can adjust by our liking. So for example, if I do 10, as you can see here, we, ha we have actually um, our uh, taskbar rounded. So I will click apply right here as well and click X. So here we have rounded taskbar. Now I will uh, also install uh, modern flyouts. I believe right here we have modern flyouts, brand new from Sam G. I will install this one as well. And here, uh, as we are installing uh, modern flyouts, I will also install this app, files app from year uh, A. Here I will also click no thanks. So when that's done, I will go straight back to you guys. So I will launch our files, and as you can see, guys. We have brand new files uh, app for our Windows. So we don't actually need this file explorer, explorer anymore. So I will unpin it from the taskbar and I will pin this one to the taskbar. So as you can see, we have beautiful new uh, file explorer from Windows 11. So I hope that uh, modern flyouts are already installed. So here we have modern flyouts preview. I will click on them on this app. And as you can see here, we have modern flyouts. So here we have uh, a, a default flyout uh, style. We have Windows default and modern flyout. We have also some uh, personalization, but I believe that this is uh, all good and we don't need to change anything right here. I think this is quite nice. And if we guys uh, get uh, a brand new wallpaper from Windows 11, um, so we go to the uh, our web browser and search for uh, Windows 11 wallpaper and uh, with that uh, wallpaper we our transformation from Windows 10 will be also complete. So I will go to Windows um, 11 wallpaper and search for some brand new wallpaper. Let's see this one from BCC. So here we have our wallpapers, I believe these ones look quite nice. But guys, uh, as I mentioned uh, earlier, earlier in my other video uh, explaining the Windows 11, go check it out guys. It will also pop up on right, on right, top right uh, on YouTube as well. So here we have our Windows uh, 11 wallpaper, I will open it in new tab and click um, uh, save image as, click save and I will set it as uh, our, our default background on the windows. So as you can see we have brand new windows 12 wallpaper. Thank you sticking with me till the end of this tutorial. I hope this video helped you to customize your windows 10 and if you haven't already subscribed to the channel is much appreciated. And also, if you are interested to other Windows 10 tweaks and customizations, check out my other videos. And with that being said, I see you all in the next video.
Peace.